What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be taking a look at this little knife here. So this is a $5 knife from Walmart. Picked it up today and first let's take a look at the packaging here. So 7 inch folding knife, stainless steel blade, polypropylene handle. And that's pretty much all on the front. You flip it over to the back and it just basically says three inch stainless steel blade, four inch polypropylene handle, shaft lock, and pocket clip. I've looked on here multiple times. I do not see any indication on uh, steel quality. So this is probably the bottom of the barrel steel that you can possibly get. Now they were going for a Benchmade bug out vibe here as you can tell uh, they have their own version of a access lock which they call a shaft lock uh, They have a deep carry pocket clip and they have kind of a very useful everyday carry blade shape um, So so far the action is absolute. This is horrible. I mean it closes I mean you have to close it with two hands or you have to just if you have a table near you you just push down on the table and close it uh, opening it, the flipper is not good at all. Uh, the thumb stud is decent. If I can get it. Thumb stud is decent. Let's see if I can reverse flick it. It's probably not. Oh, there you go. Kind of got it. So far, this knife does feel incredibly cheap. Let's test out the sharpness of it out of the box. It does feel pretty sharp, but let's see if it can cut some cardboard. So not horrible, not the worst I've ever seen out of the box. Okay, so there is straight out of the box um, sharpness. Now, I wanted to do a little, um, you know, challenge with this knife, is I wanted to use this thing for a work week. So on my phone here, you can see today is Sunday, the 17th of December. I'm going to use this thing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So five work days. Now, when I test a knife, I, that's what I usually do. I usually take it to work and I use it for about a week. I work in a warehouse. I do a, I open a ton of packages, probably close to about 30 boxes a day. And that's on a really like average day. Um, I open a lot of packages, a lot of mail, and just working in a warehouse, having a good knife is very, very useful. And I wanted to see how this thing would perform just, you know, straight out of the box. I'm not going to sharpen this thing for an entire week. I'm not going to do anything to it. I'm not going to loosen anything. I'm the knife. I am just going to leave the knife alone, do what I usually do with all my other knives and just see how this thing is um, hanging in there after a week of, you know, being where I work. And December is a busy time where I work. So this is going to be a really fun little challenge. I want to see how good a $5 knife does. Now, so far, I mean, the ergonomics on this thing are pretty comfortable. So that, you know, has that going for it. There's no jimping. Uh, obviously, you got the polypropylene scales, and then you have steel liners inside. Um, the pocket clip does seem pretty good. You got, you got a deep carry clip. It's got that going for it. So that's pretty cool. I actually like the design of the knife. It's actually pretty sleek looking, but obviously it's not a, you know, a bench made access lock. So, um, it's kind of loosening up a little bit, but I'm really having to put some effort into getting that open and, oh, there we go. It's working now, kind of. I'm having to put a lot of work into doing that, though. So anyway, I'm going to use this thing for an entire week. So I will see you guys on uh, Friday night after I get home from work, and I will finish this review then. Um, I'm just going to see how good, you know, how well the steel holds up, if it stays sharp. I'm going to see just if the, if the knife will even hold up at all. Because, you know, that's always been my question is how good is a $5 knife? So that is basically what this video is about. How good is a $5 knife from Walmart actually? So I'll test it for you guys and I'll see you in a week. All right, guys, it has now been a whole entire week. It is now Friday and I've used this knife for an entire week. And I'm just going to say this. I am super, super, super impressed with this knife. 
Um, it honestly, it performed way better than I ever thought a $5 Ozark Trail knife uh, could perform. As you see, the action has gotten a lot better. It was really, really stiff out of the box, um, but after using it for, you know, about 48 hours, it actually broke in really well. The action is really not that bad now. Uh, it's still kind of hard to push it with one finger. Oh, I just did it there. But um, you have to kind of give everything a little flick of the wrist and um, that will help it open. But the action is honestly really good. Um, I have not done anything to this knife. I have not added any lubrication to the, you know, to the pivot. Um, I haven't sharpened it at all or anything like that. So, so to test how sharp this thing is after a week of me using this knife, and just to let you know, I've probably opened about 100 packages with this knife. Um, that includes mail, cutting open tape, breaking down boxes, cutting through cardboard. I mean, I've put this thing through the ringer throughout this past week. And so we're going to now do a paper test to see if it can cut through. This is just standard 8x11 printer paper. And we're going to see if it passes the paper test. And if it does, I will be severely impressed. Oh. It's honestly way better than I thought. I'd say it's like a... I wouldn't say it passed, but I'll give it like a C. Like a C minus. And now I want to see if I can put a working edge back on it with just this uh, regular old work sharp field sharpener here. So we're going to do, we'll do 10 strokes. Okay, so that's 10 strokes on each side. Let's see if that cuts any better. Oh, uh, cuts, cuts a little better. Oh, way better. So there you go. That's a working edge, I'd feel. That's a pretty good, that's a pretty, ooh, that's a pretty good paper test. So just probably 20 strokes of that, you know, work sharp field sharpener um, gave it a working edge. And that's, you know, that's the thing with these, you know, cheaper steels, they're pretty soft, so resharpening them is actually really, really easy. But, you know, I actually did, you know, I was using it at work today and uh, it opened all the packages that I was, um, you know, that I threw at it. It cut the tape, you know, it did its job. It did cut through some cardboard. There is no blade play. I mean, the lockup is super solid. So no blade play here. And if I close it, there is no blade play here either. It's honestly really, really solid. I mean, for five bucks, you really can't find a better deal. I mean, I've been I've been flicking it this whole time. The action's honestly really good for you know it being a five dollar knife. I mean, I'm really impressed with this thing. And I honestly really like the design of it. I mean, while using it, I found it to be really comfortable. Um, you know, the flipper tab almost acts as a little finger choil to stop your finger from sliding up. Uh, really, really good blade design. I, you know, I really like the pocket clip. I like the locking mechanism. I mean, this knife is honestly really solid. So I'll link this knife down in the description for you guys so you can go check it out or swing by your local Walmart. You know, whatever, whatever floats your boat. But that is going to do it. Thank you guys very much for watching. Have a great holiday season, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay humble. Peace.